Hey, this is Pastor Brian with your first at home video. And today I've been thinking about uh, God giving us our daily bread, or I was thinking about manna in the wilderness in the Old Testament Exodus story, uh, where each day the people got just enough to get through that day. And they always had to trust that God was going to give them what they needed for each day. Uh, and that's something that we still pray for in the, in the Lord's Prayer. Give us this day our daily bread. Uh, now, what exactly... What exactly are we praying for when we pray for daily bread? Because, uh, you know, we, we get a whole lot more variety than, than just bread. Uh, Martin Luther talked about it this way in the small catechism. He says, daily bread includes everything needed for this life, such as food and clothing, home and property, work and income, a devoted family, an orderly community, good government, government favorable weather, peace and health, a good name, and true friends and neighbors. You know, I've been praying for good weather a lot here lately. I guess uh, sunshine, whether we have it or not, seems to affect my mood a whole lot. So on these kind of dark and dreary days where um, I, I'm trying to stay at home and I need to be indoors because the weather's not that great outside, I, I pray for good weather. And that's part of our daily bread that uh, we pray for as a part of that uh, that Lord's Prayer. Um, and you know, we, we get daily bread every day, whether we pray for it, whether we ask for it or not, uh, we get a whole lot of things in a in an old version of Luther's small catechism. It included shoes as part of our, our daily bread, uh, a reminder that you can't even leave the house without um, this gift from God. And all those things might seem minor compared to um, some of the changes that we're praying for and things we really hope to see in this world. Um, but there's, there's a practice here. Um, there's a, the attitude of gratitude <laughs> that's comes from a long tradition uh, from long ago in this Lord's Prayer uh, in praying and asking God and being in the practice of um, knowing that we need this daily bread, these simple and easy things, um, and also knowing that God will give them, but being reminded to be uh, grateful for them and to, to give thanks for all the things that God gives us on a daily basis so that we get in this habit of trusting all good things come from God and that God is eager to give us what we need for this life and for the life to come. Uh, and then in our, in our prayer, we're reminded of that. And uh, I need those reminders every day because there's lots to get me down and depressed about what's not changing or what's not going the way I want it to in this world. But to be reminded that um, all the things that God does give me that I need each day and that God will give me what I need for tomorrow um, and each of the days of this life to come. And he wants to give these things to you as well. And so we take time in prayer to give thanks to God for all of these different kinds of daily bread and trust that he will give us daily bread for the rest of this life and give us what we need to take us into the life to come with him as well. Hope you have a great week. I look forward to our next first at home video with you.